Hey guys, Jessica here, the Furry Family Coach, and in today's video, we are going to be talking about feeding pumpkin to your pets. Okay, so it is generally recognized that if your pet, ha if your dog specifically has an upset tummy, one of the things you can and should feed is pumpkin to help them with their tummy issues. But we're going to be talking about other wonderful benefits of feeding pumpkin to your dog in this video, so stick with me. Really quick before we get started, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, look right down there, click that like button for the YouTube algorithm. Also, make sure you are subscribed. If you look at that subscribe button and it is red, go ahead and click it and turn it gray. When that happens, a bell will appear. Click the bell, select all notifications, that way YouTube can notify you every single time I post a new video and you know you don't wanna miss a single video. One of the veterinarians I follow, her name is Julie, and her blog, her website is Adored Beast. They also have some really wonderful products, which I am not at all affiliated with, and I they are not sponsoring this video, but I will link her blog down below in the description because I absolutely love the Adored Beast, and the store is called Adored Beast Apothecary, but she recently came out with an article, a blog post about pumpkin. And there were so many really amazing benefits of pumpkin, not just for us, because pumpkin is also really good for us to eat, but also for our pets. So I wanted to share all of the really wonderful nutritional benefits that feeding pumpkin, not just when your dog has an upset tummy, but just throughout the week in general and why it is such a good idea and all of the wonderful nutrition that it can provide to your pet. So pumpkin is very fiber rich, which is one of the main reasons why we would reach for it when our dog has an upset tummy because fiber is going to help move things through the digestive system easier. It's going to help clean out any yuckiness in the gut because it's just going to move things through. That's what fiber does. And pumpkin is high in fiber. So that's why we tend to reach for it. But pumpkin has some really amazing benefits outside of just the fiber benefit. So pumpkin also contains vitamin A, also known as beta carotene, which is really great for eyesight and overall eye health. It also contains potassium, which is good for regulating blood pressure. It improves the health of your muscles, your dog's muscles and it assists in metabolism. It contains vitamin C, which we all know is really amazing for our immune health. It also has iron. Yes, even iron. Pumpkin is amazing for iron, which assists in the formation of red blood cells and hemoglobin. It also contains zinc. And let me tell you, you may have heard a lot about zinc this year. It is a wonder drug in my opinion, but zinc is actually known for great skin and coat health. It contains phosphorus, which is great for bone health. And it also contains magnesium, which helps with hormone function, maintaining electrical balances across membranes, and maintaining calcium movement into the muscles. Pumpkin also has lots of great benefits for gut health. And all of this can be found, like I said, in the blog post that I have linked in the description below from Dr. Jolie at Adored Beast. Pumpkin is not only great for runny stool, it's also really good for constipation, which is weird, right? Because those two things are very different. Like if your stool is, if your dog's stool is runny or if your dog is constipated, you would think those are two very different things and you would need two very different things to combat those. But no, no, no. Pumpkin is a wonder food and helps treat both because of its fiber content and how our body uses the soluble fiber in pumpkin. So even if your dog is not having gut issues, isn't having diarrhea, or isn't constipated, adding some pumpkin into their diet on a regular basis just helps keep their overall gut health in good condition. Additionally, the soluble fiber in pumpkin also acts as a prebiotic. And you may ask what a prebiotic is because there is a difference in prebiotics and probiotics. So probiotics we know is the beneficial bacteria in our gut. So it's the gut bacteria that is good for us. And we want that to flourish. We want a lot of good gut bacteria going on. That's what keeps us healthy. That's what keeps our immune system strong. So a prebiotic, which is what the fiber in pumpkin is, prebiotics actually stimulate the growth and activity of probiotics in the gut. Prebiotics like pumpkin also inhibit the growth of the bad bacteria that we don't want. So how do you feed pumpkin? 
just on a normal weekly basis, one to two teaspoons a couple of times a week is going to be amazing at adding all of these wonderful nutritional benefits, especially when we're talking about the gut health of your dog. Adding just a couple of teaspoons a few times a week is going to be a game changer for your dog. Whether you're feeding a raw diet, a kibble diet, and I know I've talked about diets a lot on my channel. If you are feeding kibble or whatever you are feeding your dog, if you're interested in learning more about nutrition, definitely check out, I will link in the description below, a couple of different playlists on my channel because I talk about food and pets a lot on this channel. It is like a passion of mine. <laughs> so if you have any questions at all, make sure to comment down below and let me know. If you just have a comment, also, post that in the comments down below. I love to hear from you, and I try to answer as many comments and questions as I possibly can. And don't forget the blog post that I have linked in the description below that Dr. Julie put up. It is a wealth of knowledge. It covers everything I talked about in this video and has a wonderful treat recipe for pumpkin dog treats. And if you're looking for more dog treat recipes, I have a ton of those on my YouTube channel as well. I will link them in the description below. I would also love for you to check out the other links in my descriptions, especially the link to my Amazon storefront because I have personally handpicked and curated this list of all of my favorite items for your pets that are available on Amazon. So definitely check that out. I spent a lot of time handpicking these items just for you and your dog and cat. Thank you so much for joining me in this video today on YouTube. I really appreciate each and every one of you for joining me here. I thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I would not be able to do this without you watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Go ahead and click that like button for the YouTube algorithm and look right down there right down there that subscribe button if it's red go ahead and click it and turn it gray when that happens a bell will appear next to it click the bell select all notifications so YouTube can actually notify you and tell you every time I post a new video that way you don't have to come searching for them YouTube will just say hey Jessica posted a video click right here you click it and it'll take you right to my new video thank you so much for being here with me today I can't wait to see you in the next video Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you never miss another video.